Hello readers. Today we are going to talk about a big word. That word is stamina. Stamina. Stamina is how long you can do something without giving up or stopping. Can you say stamina? Stamina. You have stamina for different things. Maybe you have very long stamina for riding your bike. You can just bike, bike, bike all the time. I do not have long stamina for running. I cannot run for a very long time without stopping. But I do have long stamina for going for a walk. I could go for a really long walk without stopping. Maybe you have pretty long stamina for video games. You could play video games for a long time without stopping. I want you to think for a moment of things that you have long stamina for. What is something you can do for a long time without stopping? Playing outside? Looking at your books? Playing games with your family? Going on the swing? Shopping? Now I want you to think of things that you don't have very long stamina for yet. What is something you cannot do for a very, very long time? I cannot do push-ups for a very, very, very long time. My stamina is a little short. Stamina. But the amazing thing about stamina is if you practice and you don't give up, you can grow your stamina. That means you can do it for longer and longer. And we are going to try to grow ourselves in kindergarten as readers and even writers. Someday we'll grow our writing stamina and math thinkers just by adding a few minutes to those parts of the day, you can grow yourself and you can grow your stamina. Most of the time, I have had a five minute timer hooked on to our reading lessons. So you can grab up your books, press the timer, and that's only five minutes because most of you are about five years old. And that's a good place to start. Five minutes is a good place to start, but we can grow our stamina by adding a little bit of time to make ourselves longer readers and writers. When I find a book that I love, I can have very long stamina as a reader. When I find a comfortable chair inside my house or outside my house, I can have very long stamina as a reader. And that's what I'm hoping to grow with you. If you grab up lots of books and find a good place and you do that quickly and quietly and you try your best, you'll be able to grow your stamina as a reader. So today, underneath this lesson, I'm gonna set a six minute timer. And then later we might have a seven minute timer. And later we might have a 10 minute timer. If you can keep going longer than the timer, that's awesome. Another thing you could do is read for five minutes in the morning. And then you could come back to this and read again in the afternoon. And that would really help you grow as a reader. And then your grown up could read a bedtime story to you at night. And then you would have many times throughout the day to build your reading skills and your thinking skills. So today, stamina, stamina, stamina. You're gonna grow your stamina today and every day by keeping your eyes in your text, in your book, 
keeping your brain on your book. Don't let it wander. Oh, bring it back and build your stamina. Don't let your eyes wander. Oh, bring it back and build your stamina. Say stamina. Stamina. We're going to be growing our stamina as readers. Can't wait to hear how it's going.